Hi friends, in this video I am going to talk about the methods which can be useful to resolve the Windows Update Error 8024A105. If you find this video useful, please like this video and subscribe to this channel. And also kindly press that bell icon so that if any future up videos will come, you will get the notification. So first method will be just try to reboot your system. Because it always work in Windows Update some in many scenarios. So just go to power button and try to restart the system or reboot the system. Once the reboot is done, come back to the system and try to change your internet connection. Just go to the setting and in the setting option go to the internet option. And if you are using a Wi-Fi connection, just change to Wi-Fi to LAN and if you are using a LAN, change to LAN to Wi-Fi. So this method is very popular especially in this uh, Windows Update Error 8024A105. So try it and if, if it doesn't work then we will go for the third method. So third method is basically what we have to do. We have to go again go to the setting and in setting we have to go to the update and security. In update and security what we have to do you have to in update and security what you have to do you have to go to the, the troubleshoot option and you have to troubleshoot the windows update troubleshoot. So go to windows update and go to troubleshoot. So it will try to search all the files or issue which is causing this window update error and as in my system there is this error is not coming that's why it's, this file this troubleshoot will not give any uh, issue but surely in your case it will give. Now if troubleshooter method doesn't work then we will go to command prompt and run it as administrator. Now you have to type some commands which I am showing you. So first command will be net stop w u a u s c r v. So here what is we are doing we are stopping the window update service. Now second command will be net stop crypt svc. So we are stopping here uh, cryptographic services. So you have to type this and cryptographic services will start stopping. Now again this yeah, type command net stop bits and this command will stop background intelligence transfer services after this go again and to, uh, type this net stop msi scrvr so we are stopping uh, the server for update here installer windows installer service so after this you have to i am what i am going to do i am going to change the name of the software distribution folder in our windows so type this command and press enter and again type another command windows system 32 cart root 2 folder of windows in of windows system 32 i am changing here and this is it now after this what you have to do again start all those services which we have start, uh, stopped earlier so type this command net start windows update services but then stop uh, cryptographic services then start business intel, intel uh, background intelligence services and finally start the, the windows update installer So this windows installer service is started after this i am going to show you the folders name which we have changed for that we have to go to the c drive in c drive in program file uh, in windows go to the system 32 before that there is software software distribution folder look at here software distribution folder change to software distribution dot old so this is a new folder which get created and that is the old one which have which name was software distribution dot old you can see it we have to go back and downside this another folder software distribution dot old this is the old folder similarly in system 32 we have changed the uh, the cart root 2 folder name you have to go here and cart root 2 dot old you can see here it's got changed to cart root dot old so this is this is the thing we have done with that those commands after that what you have to do you have to just again go to the command prompt and command prompt you have to type exit 
type exit so it will come out of the command form and now go to the powershell for that type powershell windows powershell open it and start the windows update and you can start it by using this command first we have to run as administrator and then you have to type this command v w u a u c l t dot e x e slash update now so you are basically starting the windows update press enter and after that you have to just restart your system i'm not updating it you have to update it and then you have to just restart your system this method again you have to go to command prompt and run it as administrator so basically this windows update error come because of the corrupt file so we are going to use dism tool to remove or to detect that corrupt file so uh, please type this command in your uh, command prompt dism and uh, slash online slash cleanup slash check health cleanup and check health so once you execute this command uh, in your windows system 32 file so what you it will give it will give that corrupt file name with the dism tool and you have to remove that file name here for me this there is nothing that component is getting detected because i have that i'm not facing that issue so try it in your system if you face this issue and remove that file so and if any of this method helps you uh, please subscribe this channel and comment me if you want uh, any video on windows related issues or query i will make video on that thanks for watching please like share and subscribe to this channel thank you